Namaste, Soul Tribe, Spiritual Healer, back to give you guys a message. Hi, my beautiful Aries, my baby bosses, my kings and queens. Hope you guys are well and safe. I hope you guys are enjoying um, your Sunday, okay? Let's get right into your messages. When I was about to record your video, the video stopped recording. Somebody doesn't want this message to get out, first of all. I started pulling some of these cards and all these cards came out, so I left them on my desk so that way I can relay this message so for whoever it, for whoever needs to get this message. Okay? I feel like um, you are having some sort of spiritual upgrades right now. You're having a lot, a lot of ascension symptoms. Okay? So you need to, like, get plenty of rest. My beautiful Aries, get plenty of rest. Because you're having ascension symptoms, you're having some sort of DNA activations going on, crown chakra activations going on, or uh, crown chakra blockages being removed, okay? Because somebody, you could have been having a lot of headaches, or out of um, frequent headaches is specific for somebody here, okay? So somebody was doing the most, projection, projecting some sort of dark energy towards your crown chakra, or dark thoughts and energy projecting fear and anxiety here. This is what I got, projecting fear and anxiety, you denied access to this person of your energy. You could have blocked this person, denied them access. And this person started to gossip about you, lie about you, slander behind the scenes about you. All right? This is a karmic female that's obsessed with you, Aries, male or female, projecting fear and anxiety because you denied access to this person. You walked away. Uh, you figured them out or something. You figured something out, all right? And... um. You, whoever you are, you've been trying to heal yourself with self-love, but every time you're trying to heal yourself with self-love, somebody's always trying to get you in your feelings, or somebody's always trying to do some uh, sort of spell work or energy work towards you. Uh, somebody's trying to astral travel or astral project into your energy. You could have caught this person. You could have caught somebody um, astral projecting into your dreams. You could have caught somebody... Um, you could have caught somebody astral projecting um, into your energy. Um, through meditation or through a vision or you tapped into somebody's conversation here and this person was warned this person was warned i heard amy abigail abby lillian or lily lewis Luther, I heard Luther. Okay, somebody's called for using your information here too. This card came out and that you're going to be compensated because you, whoever you are, there's a lot of things that have been done against you. A lot of, of cyberbullying, okay? A lot of hacking into your accounts or emails. A lot of um, somebody putting some sort of video or photos of you online or on the dark web. Uh, they've been doing the most, using your information to, like, apply for, like, a loan or a PPP loan or using your information um, in order to obtain some sort of access to some sort of money or uh, lawsuit money or this could have been an inheritance money. But you are going to be compensated, but whoever you are, you might need to testify. A CEO boss, some of you guys are bossing up or there's a CEO boss that's interested in you, all right, or a CEO or a boss that was, like, working in behind the scenes that was trying to destroy you because you could have been putting out some sort of information that was taking down a CEO or a boss of a company, or this could be specific for somebody and for somebody else, the CEO or boss energy could be somebody that wants to work with you, collaborate with you, and that wants to give you an offer that's watching you, that's admiring you, okay? This person is uh, impressed by your work, or this person um, feels like you will be a valuable asset to their team or their firm or their company, it's time for you to stay alone and reflect, okay? Because there's a lot going on at the workplace, too. A lot going on at the workplace with a lot of envy, jealousy. Somebody tried to set somebody else at the, uh, up at the workplace to lose their job, all right? In, um, entrapment or incriminating somebody here. Setting somebody up for failure. Mm -hmm. What is going on? Somebody's upset. They don't want you to have a firm foundation. They don't want you to have a happy home. They don't want you to live your best life. But if, if that's what God said, that's what it is, okay? Somebody's um, doing the most. Somebody's getting exposed, having a secret love affair. Secret lovers exposed, all right? And this is somebody that could have been a doppelganger energy to you. This is somebody that could have been close to you once upon a time. This is somebody that could be in your family, somebody that looks like you, um, that was 
using your information in order to get something, okay? And this person was secretly uh, going around, sleeping with your ex or sleeping with the person you were dealing with. There's a driver or, or like somebody driving or stalking you past driving past your home. Yeah, you are forced to be reckoned with and you, this person, somebody's being forced to awaken, all right? Because they tried on the last full moon or on this full moon, they tried to do something and it was like an instant backfire. And this person is forced to awaken about you, you and your gifts and that you are divinely protected, okay? Somebody started hacking you once you awaken because once you awaken, okay, that's when, um, okay, so let me explain this to you. If you are part of the chosen collective, if you have gifts, if you're an earth angel healer, if you're a light worker, if you're a reader or you're intuitive and you have um, spiritual gifts, and you started to access your spiritual gifts. You started to uh, implement these certain spiritual cleanses or spiritual uh, things into your life. I heard holistic healing. You, you, you know, you could be good with Reiki healing or you could be a Reiki master or that. Or you could be good with astrology. Whatever you're good at doing. Um, as soon as you had this epiphany or as soon as you awakened to your gifts, as soon as, as soon as you started using your gifts. This is when the whole group of people in your community and your family or in the society, they started working against you or they started following you, watching you, okay? So as soon as you activated your DNA, your crystalline DNA, as soon as you accessing your Akashic Records or as soon as you figured out what was going on in your life and you figured out that you were actually guided to uh, fulfill some sort of prophecy or purpose and you started to move towards that, that's when these uh, watchers started being activated, these demonic entities started hacking the into other people's bodies in order to, like, target you, follow you, watch you. For some of you guys, you were switched at birth, all right? It was an orchestrated adoption or somebody here orchestrated some sort of adoption here in order to sacrifice the chosen one. Wow. X created rumors. They backfired. Somebody's been looking through your stuff, all right? They was trying to find some sort of information on you or somebody was doing background checks or somebody was literally looking through your stuff at your home if you let this person in your home. They took something that belonged to you with your energy on it and they took it somewhere else to, to an ex of yours or to a practitioner so they could do spell work on it. Like, this is all backfiring here. So wherever you are, you're getting a sudden payout of money and somebody's auntie is here being watched for a stolen inheritance under investigation or this auntie is under judgment. Your auntie could be sick or ill. Somebody was tampering with your car at, at night or in the workplace parking lot. Wow, breakthrough ideas. You're having a lot of breakthrough ideas, right? And somebody's a, a real energy vampire. I heard Smith. I heard Caitlin. Vicky or Victoria. What is the energy here? There for the beautiful Aries coming towards them. I heard gummy, like gummies, like somebody's going to try to give you some sort of edible or some sort of gummy and it can have something in it that is like going to make you sick or... It, I don't know, somebody's trying to offer you something or tempt you with a gummy, okay? I don't know if this is like a THC gummy or what it is, but be careful. It could be a gummy, it could be like um, a brownie, like an edible brownie or something like that that somebody's trying to give to you. Be careful what, what you're eating around this time. Somebody wants to get you caught up. They want you in, like to intoxicate you or they want to put some sort of spiritual like uh parasite onto you to make you lose your mind somebody wants to make you lose your mind but they really want to make you lose your mind because you are speaking out or you're speaking some sort of truth or you know what you figured them out and now everything like everything's coming down crashing on somebody that you figured out that this person was trying to be your doppelganger or trying to use your be pretend to be you you are the nine of pentacles you will have victory and some sort of good news is coming in you manifested this nine of pentacles for your cup somebody wants to slow something down here for you, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy here. Um, you coming out with the six with the six of Wands is basically you coming out victorious. You coming out on top. Something going in your favor. A beautiful message or offer coming in. Like you you being vindicated in a situation. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Yeah, this is something that was meant to happen. All right, this is something that could have been delayed for a while. This is something that's happening abruptly. 
Okay, yeah, something somebody did something to uh, block the justice system from finding something out, or somebody didn't want you to get justice in a situation. Libra energy, Libra, you could have any of these signs in your chart. All right, so somebody took a leap of faith in the wrong direction. Now this person needs to face the consequences. Virgo energy with the full card in reverse. This person was very foolish. Yeah, hermit card, the Virgo. So there's heavy Virgo energy here. You could be a Virgo, or um, or you could have Virgo in your chart, or you could be dealing with one. Okay. All right, or you could be dealing with a Libra. All right, so the star card is here. The star card, okay? You are an earth angel, star energy, world-renowned energy. You are very gifted, all right? You've been chosen for something. And um, people at your workplace or where you work or coworkers or people online, all right? This, if you work online, then people online have been trying to show you fake using fake accounts, trying to mock, um, like imitate your account or trying to do something in order to gain some sort of clout or to slow you down to make you quit. And if you don't work online and you work anywhere else in the office or wherever you go to work, these, these co-workers are upset because regardless of what they did to try to hinder you, um, I don't know if you're going to sue this company. Somebody could be suing a company they work for because they were wrongfully terminated. You're going to get a lot of money from this, whoever you are. And if you're not suing this company, all right, and they and there was like karmics in this job trying to like get you fired or make you quit, somebody else here at this job is getting fired or, or, or they like there's a group of people, at least one or two people that are getting fired because they've been caught. They were caught on camera or they were caught. Doing something to sabotage you at work. Wow. And then you get a promotion, whoever you are. The hair front in the reverse. This is Taurus energy. All right. Somebody's in their darkest energy. All right. This person doesn't believe in spirituality. They don't believe in what you believe in. So they started targeting you. You, you, you probably don't even know somebody that's been targeting you online because of your spiritual beliefs. Hmm. Two of Cups is here. Taurus energy in the reverse. All right. Somebody got left out in the cold. And they see you celebrating. This person can't get into your energy. They they can just see you behind the scenes. They teamed up with a dark high priestess in the reverse, the letter B or J. I heard Barry, Brady, Belinda, Barry, James, Jared, John. I heard Jonah. Wow. So the Knight of Swords is rushing towards you because the Knight of Swords, they got something to say. They want to tell you something. Okay. Somebody wants to uh, tell you something. Something happens and somebody's uh, going to rush in and tell you something. What does this person got to say? Oh, that this person knew that these karmics were working. Okay. So this person knew that your ex and somebody in your family, this person knew that your ex was teaming up with a karmic or this was a karmic couple here. That were teaming up, that were doing things to you, spell work. This person knew about it, but they never told you. They never warned you because this person low-key was in competition with you, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This could be somebody that uh, you trusted. This could have been a friend. This could have been a family member, a sibling. All right, whoever this is, this could have been an ex. This person never warned you, but this person knew what these karmics were up to the whole time. The King of Cups, all right? So Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in the upright. Six of Cups, somebody is coming through and they this person is coming through like as if they're like your um like your soulmate. This person is coming through like they're your past life soulmate. This person is coming through to give you an offer here. All right, King of Cups here. And as soon as you get this person's offer, somebody's gonna give you an offer. Somebody from the past rushes in to try to do the right thing all of a sudden to try to tell you the truth now and confess, but it's a little too late because you already been through the most. You already don't trust this person, and they're going to try to show up as soon as this new offer comes in, Aries. So just be aware of this energy here. This person is, has been behind the scenes keeping this close to their chest. They knew what people were doing. They probably participated in the attacks against you, and now this person is rushing towards you because something came crashing down for them, and it didn't work out. Okay, or they, they, they really want to stop you from having this union with this soulmate that you're meant to be with. Mm. Official mail is coming. Pay attention to your mail. Official mail. I heard um, church. Somebody could be eating church chicken or this church chicken. That's what I heard. Or somebody could be uh, from the church. And from the church, they've been stalking you. Your family is a group of warlocks that belong to the church. Or there's a church that pretends to be a church and pretends to be holy, but they're a group of warlocks. That's crazy. But you have a new business venture coming in.
I heard Oscar. I heard the name Oscar. Spring love. Okay, so what's up with this spring love energy? Time traveler. Mm, new home and new apartment. So you guys are shifting timelines. Okay, you have this time traveler energy here. And you guys are shifting timelines. And you guys are about to manifest a new home or a new place. All right, for those of you that are manifesting that, that's about to come through. You're, you're about to find this new place for yourself, your sanctuary. Because you can't live with anybody. So if you were living with somebody else or you were living somewhere and you were being like stalked by your neighbors or you were being targeted by your community or if you were living with somebody and they were doing the most to take your energy, the most high God is going to uproot you from that environment and you are about to get this new place. You could be dealing with somebody with the letter E, F, or G. You could have met somebody in the springtime. And this person went ghost or MIA or they just didn't offer you what you wanted or you figured that this person was connected with somebody else or they, they had unresolved issues. This person's coming back around now. The letter J, K, or L is here. Somebody could be waking up to a flat tire or somebody's trying to mess with somebody's car. Tires of their car to flatten their tires. Wow. Brandon or Brayden. Abel. Stone, oh, I heard Adam or Adams. Family lies are exposed in different nationality, all right? So for somebody watching, your real family was a different nationality. You could have been secretly adopted into this family. That's a specific message. And for somebody else, somebody that's a different nationality here is getting exposed or they're going to come towards you and tell you the truth about your family's lies and secrets. All right, you get to start over for a new life here. Somebody's trying to trap you in some sort of bad contract or deal. Because you're a powerful healer, they want to um, somehow compromise your soul to get you stuck in a bad contract or deal. Be careful. Somebody's bringing you an object or a gift. Be careful. Make sure you clean that, uh, that energy off of it. Something had bad energy attached. Somebody could have green eyes or blue eyes. In three days, you're going to get an important phone call. Somebody's a weak link, and like I said, they're rushing towards you to confess something all of a sudden. Because this person's going through the most. This person is feeling haunted, all right? This person that should have told you the truth when they had the chance to. This person that you cared about and you helped multiple times. Now they're rushing towards you. Somebody secretly watches your social media. This could be a dark-skinned female. You could be a dark-skinned female. You could be dealing with one. Oh, yeah, it's coming to bring a bad storm to these individuals, all right? This karmic female that loves spells to keep a masculine stuck or to bind herself to a masculine. This karmic air sign female, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, was a fake friend to you, all right? Somebody's a heavy smoker. Somebody's checking you out. Somebody could be going to the hospital. Somebody could be finding out they have some sort of cancer because they're a heavy smoker. That's a side message. Sending informants here. Mm. There's a cousin involved, somebody you can't trust. The letter B, M, L, C, or J. Mm -mm. Pay attention to the signs and the synchronicities. Pay attention to your dreams. The, your dreams are telling you a lot of messages right now. One of your ancestors that passed away is going to come in your dreams and give you like a specific message. Pay attention. Well, somebody's uh, hiding behind a false account, all right? Somebody's hiding behind a false account. This person's been obsessed with watching you, everything you do. All right, this person um, is trying to like swap destinies with you or this person is trying to like entrap you in some sort of deal or they're trying to um, do something here that's not quite right here. You feel it in your gut. Somebody is giving you weird energy. This could be online. I should have expressed myself better. Somebody didn't express herself. Somebody held back their emotions and their feelings and now they're trapped in some sort of dark timeline. All right, because this person was too busy living in their ego. In their, and you are in your north node or you're headed to your north node soul tie. Somebody created a soul tie with you. They wanted to remain connected, binded to you. This person could have been a different nationality than you, but somebody here has created a soul tie. So cord cutting meditations. Somebody's draining you out. Pay attention to your money. Somebody is trying to block your money here. Understanding your story. Somebody was, like I said, was sent to watch you and spy on you. But now this person sees that, you know what, you're... You, you were wronged, okay? You were actually the victim in a situation. These people actually teamed up to take you down or, or do whatever they wanted to do, slow you down, even take you out, okay? But somebody's starting to see that you you, you were not the bad guy in the story, that there was a lot of crimes done against you, and somebody's looking up everything about you and your past and everything you've been through, and this is why this uh, investigator is going to help you or this freaking uh, 
agent spy. Like, I feel like somebody hired, like, a private investigator. And now this one private investigator is finding out the truth about everything these people have done to you. And this person is actually helping you now. If somebody feels your absence, and somebody else is unsatisfied here because they didn't get the results they wanted when they did their moon magic on you. Mm -mm -mm. Wow, you're irreplaceable and somebody knows it, but you don't want nothing to do with them. You, you need your time and space away from this person. Playing emotional mind games with you, manipulation tactics, or just going on both sides of the fence. You figured it out. Wow. And they wanted you to miss an opportunity, so make sure you're not missing any opportunities. Somebody wants to get you in some sort of bad habit or give you something that's not good for you. All right, to get you to go back to your old toxic ways or or somebody has a bad habit and you need to detach from them. All right. Yeah. Somebody's in their shadow side and somebody here could be wanting like somebody's overwhelmed. So if you're overwhelmed, take a break, take a time to meditate, relax, take a spiritual cleanse, go out in nature, talk to the most high God and get comfort in most high God. But if this is not you overwhelmed, then somebody is overwhelmed because uh, they did the most and, and they didn't really get nowhere. They, they, there's a lot of tower moments. There's a lot of truth. There's a lot of exposure going on around this karmic masculine dealing with that karmic female in your life that they were trying to destroy you. All right. This is your reading. This is your message. I hope that helped. Till the next time. Namaste.